But I also thought about the lower pay the philosophers got compared to medical doctors, and maybe more importantly, the lower respect that philosophers received. My personal failure was I wasn't brave enough to accept and fully defend what I loved. I saw my classmates around me flourishing in being shaped by the country's best medical institution. But for me, I wanted my rock to have a shape different from medicine. Unlike me, my classmates were starting to ascend to the water's altitude. One of my female classmates and I would come up with different ways to tell our parents that we would like to get out of med. One approach was to start with awful news first to make the next piece of news seem lighter. For instance, my friend would say, Ma, I'm pregnant. On a lighter note, I quit med. As for me, because back then, I still wasn't out to my family, I'd say, Ma, I'm gay. On a lighter note, I quit med. I spent three and a half years in med school before quitting. After I did, I was very lucky that my family, relatives, and friends somewhere out there have been very supportive from one career change to the next and from one failed life project after another. They are the wind beneath my wings. Wind strong enough to make me feel like fluttering as high as the water's orbit. I feel bad when I hear stories of students who do not have the same support system that I have. I hope the youth can be encouraged to take whatever they want to study. When I quit, I finally accepted what I was and was not willing to do with my life. I have one life to live, and I am going to try to flourish and soar no matter what anyone says. Here in Diliman, my first day was like a new life for me. I was excited to go to class. I wanted more and more philosophy, accepting what I loved and daring to be different finally inspired me to be the best that I could be. When we are inspired, we do our best work. When we do our best work, we can offer the best service to our countrymen, which is after all what Oble is known to symbolize. It is in the interest of society that we put each other in situations that will inspire us to do our best work for the people. When scientists, artists, and philosophers do their best, it is not only the individual, but also society that soars. We need all of them in a tragedy where 49 people were shot dead. It's medical science that heals the victims' bodies and minds. It's art that inspires the survivors to move forward. And it's philosophy that forms ethics to prevent another moral disaster. I have acquired scientific precision from medicine, artistic expression from creative writing, and rational open-mindedness from philosophy. All these have shaped the rock that I give to support a blessed soaring. Fellow graduates, we all have our shapes that are distinct and beautiful. Beautiful like a diwata. Ako ay isang diwata. Lahat tayo ay diwata. We, the graduates, have the potential to soar through the stratosphere from the rocks of Oble on the ground to the cosmic domain of Diwata. Our family, friends, and university mentors have shaped us to take flight. Let us thank them by soaring to the sky. Pumailan lang na tayo. Mabuhay ang mga bagong Diwata. Maraming salamat, Ginoong Lopez.